Hey guys, Dream Gamer Life here, and today I'm going to be doing a small video on how to make an open slash close GUI. So basically, when you want when you're doing this, you want to um, you know we'll go to this later, but for now you want to go to Starter GUI and you want to insert a screen GUI because that's what you need, and you want to name this screen GUI open slash close GUI and inside you want to insert an object and you want to insert a um, a well you know we'll set we'll insert this for now now you want to customize it so I'm gonna customize it so I'm gonna go to where's it style um about you nah about you. You know, we'll just do this. Um, background color, gray. Tr background transparency. Right there. So you want to um, position this so it goes um, five out. No, let's see how much should we want. You know, we'll just do 15 and then what you want to do is you want to when it comes over to here you want to do 0.5 minus 25 and in my last video it's like open I mean um, basic menu slash intro GUI basically it's like 0.5 which is about halfway down the screen and um, minus 25, which is 25 is half of that, so you have to minus and all that. You, you'll understand. And now you, so now you want to do text scaled. Um, now you could do whatever you want. So I'm going to do. Hmm, I like sci-fi, so I'm going to. I'm just going to do open. Right, instead of doing a text scaled right there, that's a lot better. Alright, so now I want to rename this. So we're going to name this um, open button. Okay, so now inside of here you want to insert any object, um, the scrolling frame or frame. Scrolling frame you have a lot more space, but I'm just going to use a frame for now. Um, so now we want to size this frame. So let's make it 600 across and 500 down. Let's do 700 across. All right, yeah, that's a lot better. Hopefully, now we want to position it to 0.5 minus 350. That's extra zero and now you want to do 0.5 minus 250 and then it'll be directly in the middle of your screen okay so now we're gonna style now we're gonna have a style um, like this mm, yeah we'll, we'll, we'll use this so we're gonna call this um, the um menu bg and inside of this we're going to be inserting um a title so let's insert a title um scroll down size yeah sorry if this is laggy it shouldn't really be laggy but um, my computer is really old now, so um, yeah. Oops. So may, it will be laggy, but in about a month um, or so, I won't be lagging at all because I'll be getting a brand new computer. Um, all right, that's good enough in size. Let's scroll down. Let's um, scale the text. Um, let's make the background transparency 
set at one. Scroll down, let's unscale that um forty two a wee bit bigger. Um yeah, scaling in this game is annoying because you have to go through so many buttons. Nine six, okay, fine. Alright, so we're gonna call this um open slash close and stuff. Okay, so now what we want to do is right there that's better. I'm just gonna click the base plate because we don't need that. Alright, so now what we want to do is we want to add um some features or whatever. So let's add a title. Um now this is only the basic one. I will do an, an advanced one soon but for now I'm just gonna do a basic. So let's get a text box and let's do it. so let's make its position two hundred and one. Oh no, not that. Oops. Let's make the text box position two hundred and one. Or just two hundred? No. Right, one hundred and fifty. Fair enough. Right, so now we're gonna make the size um one down and Ooh, about so if that's six hundred no wait if that's five hundred so minus so that'll be four hundred no three hundred and fifty. Yep, there we go. Um the background transparency can set it to one. Um text scaled now you want to make sure this is text or else it won't work. So now we're gonna write everything and anything we want. So we're gonna write it in cartoon. And we're no wait, let's actually write it in Source Sans Light. And we're going to write this as a basic open slash close GUI made by um, Dream Gamer Live. Um and yeah. So put your info here. Now you don't have to use the exact same stuff that I'm writing like the game type, you can customize it. Okay, so now we're just gonna call this the um text. Okay, so now what we want to do is we want to make it so it opens and closes because we're not done right now. So we need to add a um, a script into where is, where is it? We're gonna need to add a script into the open button. And here's what you want to write: script dot parent dot mouse button one click colon connect function. And now we want to make it so the like menu is visible when we press it. So script dot parent dot parent um dot menu bg dot visible equals true. All right, so we can close that. Now we want to add a button. It's like in here that allows you to close it. So we're wanting to insert an object. Let's insert a text button. And now you can place this wherever you want. I'm just gonna leave it in the left hand side and we're gonna make it fifty by fifty. And now we are going to make it stand out by making a reddish background. Make the background transparency five and then making the text scaled and we want to put an X in it. Okay, so that's pretty easy to look at. Um, so we're gonna call this close button. Okay, so now 
let's see what else do we want to make it um where's this index all right so make sure this index is above all the rest i like to set it at five because that means i know it's the thing so now we're going to insert an object and we're going to insert another script and we're going to basically be doing the same but script dot parent dot mouse button one click colon connect function now we want to do script dot parent dot parent dot visible equals false alright now that should work so we are now going to um, make sure like when this when you have this make sure this isn't open before the game was alright so we're now going to add a part and we're now going to uh, anchor it and we're now going to add a spawn and we're now going to press play now I have a problem it's like it doesn't sometimes this kind of bugs out so like I can see my guy so if we click this I think I know why that's not working so I am going to quickly go to the develop tab right here and I am going to go to the game okay load and now we now don't ask why this is my name because it is my name but I'm not on my dream game alive account but so we're gonna press play um I'm just gonna save these because it should work if it doesn't then I'll be extremely confused also guys I have a group for you guys if you want to join it's called banana studios and yeah so probably by about today as well um, a video will be going out so let's just test the button so open yep open slash close this ba basic open slash close GUI made by dream gamer live put your info here click X and yes it works Um. So yeah, it's working fine now, and that's a good thing. So we're gonna go back into edit, so I can quickly take a little um, picture and all that of the thing. Um, there will be a link below for the um, the Banana Studios group, and also there'll be a link below for the open slash close GUI. So yeah, um, for now I'll only be doing tutorials on this channel. Um, Nightmare Gamer Live will be doing other stuff. So yeah, oh, here's the lag. Awesome. Um, open slash close GUI menu background. Scroll down. Visible. So yeah. Um, please leave a like. Um, subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and I'll see you guys. Um next time so bye